I got beat up every single day. And I was 10 years of age, my, I didn't, I, we didn't have much money, so my, my, my mother used to dress me funny. She made these purple, crushed velvet, velour suits and a big, big bow tie. <laughs> and sent me to school in Compton, California, dressed like that. But it caused me to understand that there's a difference between being broke and being poor. Being broke is economic, but being poor is a disabling frame of mind and a depressed condition of your spirit. And you must vow never, ever, ever to be poor again. I was in India and I was, I, I had gone to this, this, this uh, university and I had spoke there and after I left, I, I got back to the hotel and I realized I didn't have my wallet. And so I called the hotel and I said, can you please bring the car back? They have my wallet. And they said, I'm sorry, sir, we don't have a car. That was a taxi. And I became a little cynical. I went from hopeful to skeptical to cynical and I started thinking the worst of people. And of course they said, well, my, my wallet is gone. By midnight they called and said, we're still trying. He's not answering the phone, the taxi cab driver. But at two in the morning they called and said, he answered his phone, his phone was off. He's coming back to your hotel with your wallet. So I get dressed and I run down stairs and a man meets me and the bellman translates in for me in India in the dialect and, and I reach into my wallet and there's $70 US. So I reach out and I say, let me give this $70 to you. This is my way of saying thank you. And the man says, no. I said, no, I don't think you understand. I'm talking about paying you. I'm talking about giving you a month's worth of your salary. One more time, he said, and this time he became a little visibly younger. He said, angry, he said, I told you no. I didn't bring you your wallet because I wanted a reward. I brought you your wallet because it's your wallet. So I said to the man, what can I do to be thankful to you? What can I do to say thank you? He said, well, the next time you're in India, come to my house and have tea. Be my friend. You gain more by giving. You get more by building. You learn more by listening. Eagles don't fly in packs. There are three types of birds. There are eagles, there are buzzards, and there are turkeys. Eagles are high altitude birds. They're regal. There's a, it's not arrogant, they're not pompous, but there's a certain regalness to an eagle. Then you've got another kind of bird. It's a buzzard. Buzzards are always stepping on your head to elevate themselves. But the worst kind of bird is a turkey because the turkey's got wings and can't even fly. All they do is profile, translation, trying to be something they are not. And I'm now gonna come right to you. What kind of bird do you wanna be?